Crunchy rides in a wagon. It simulates like a patient pulling kids in a wagon or doing yard work or helps them with their balance and strength. She weighs about 65 pounds and so that's a pretty good load. I decided that she needed to wear a crown. <laughs> so Crunchy wears a crown when she rides in the wagon. <laughs> Crunchy, uh, she plays cards, she plays war. So uh, you know, a lot of my folks have trouble attending to one side of their body. So I'll put her on that side and she will sit in a chair and pick a card out of a card holder and hand it to the client. And so they have to reach across their midline to grab the card and look at the dog and then they figure out which number is higher to see who wins. Crunchy has good luck. She tends to win most games. So. And Crunchy also reads. She reads well, three to six sight words, depending on how much we've practiced. And so I have a Q cube that um, the client can also work on reading or maybe saying the word that's, that's on the Q card and then monitoring if she completes it or not. Then we also play a bumblebee game, so it's like a kerplunk type game where she, she pulls out one piece and then the client pulls out one. And, um, the official rules are to not let the bees fall, but we think Crunchy likes the bees to fall, so it's always debatable on who actually won, but we have our clients get the bees, so it could be working on their coordination or their reaching to one side or the other. 